was exciting. I'm just trying to watch. Let's just see this slowly moving in this direction. We'll wait and sit tight. So, uh, Lynn, getting back to your question, morning or afternoon, it's hard to say. I mean, we had such a beautiful morning, and especially in winter, it warms up nicely, and, and it's a fantastic, fantastic time of the day. But the afternoon's also great, and the sunsets are beautiful. I, I, I don't know. It's hard to say. Right now, with cheetah approaching, I'd have to say the afternoon. <laughs> I see two cheetah there moving through the thicket. They should be they should break through that little scrub that they're in at the moment shortly. But there you can see them quite nicely. Wow, I haven't seen cheetah in the Sabi Sands for quite some time. I know these plains and these clearings are ideal for cheetah. And I'm not sure when last on Safari Live you saw cheetah. So this is fantastic. Like I say, they are heading straight towards us. We are just going to sit tight here for a while. Hopefully we'll get a lovely view of them as they cross over. While they are walking, they'll most likely try and scent mark Often what cheetah do is they find prominent trees and that's what that one is doing there. Can you just see it's lifted its tail, scent marking. And the reason for that is this is obviously their territory and while they're moving around they constantly scent mark. I'm assuming these are two males. It does look like it. I'm just going to move up a little, little further forward while we, while we wait for them. We might get a better view. They will also use these pushed over trees as a vantage point to have a look uh, around and scan the clearings. And the reason for that is it just gives them a nice area, a nice little bit of a raised platform that they may scan and look around. So often cheetah, they don't climb as well as lion or leopard, especially not leopard, but they do jump into trees and they will mainly, like I said, jump into trees. It's mainly trees that have been pushed over. They're a bit easier for them to climb into and they'll stand on that and scan. And from that vantage point, they can have a look if there's any prey. Let's see. I don't see them now. Just trying to scan again. So I understand that everybody is as excited as I am about cheetah because these are my first cheetahs for Safari Live. I know you have seen them a few times and <laughs> this is amazing. I'm very excited because I don't know this coalition. I'm, like I say, I'm assuming it is a male coalition from what I've seen already. I think they are. So we'll hopefully get them coming out. Don't see them at the moment. I'm still scanning, but this is incredible. <laughs> As I said, it's too soon to panic. You never know what you're going to bump into. And look at that. Two cheetah walking towards us. Let me just scan again quickly. Yeah, there, I see them. Yeah, VM has got them. That's great. They're moving further into the open, but still in our direction. Andrew or Mike, any station on this channel, do you copy me? 
Good afternoon, it's Byron here. Um, located the two uh, male cheat of the coalition. They are on the plains, and I think we are we're, um, east of Hornball Nest Road, and they are heading north. There are three double M vehicles here at the moment, but they are heading north. I'm just going to turn around quickly, everyone. Oh, this is very exciting. These cheats are heading straight towards us. So, Safari Dude has asked, are these cheetah heading towards the, the zebra? No, I don't think they are. A zebra is far too large for a cheetah to hunt. And um, I think the zebra would have got a fright because it's still a predator and natural instinct will kick in and the zebra will probably just move off, which is, I think, what happened there. But these, these cheetah will not be trying to hunt those zebra at all. They may go for a zebra foal, but it's, it's unlikely and doesn't happen often. But if there's a zebra foal around, they could probably show some interest and try and hunt that. But, uh, but in this situation, not at all. So while we're waiting for these cheetah to cross and trying to get into a better position, go across to James, get an update from him and see what he's up to.